Okay guys, so we came, we registered, uh, we got our map, which my daughter has in a plastic bag because today was supposed to be sunny, but we're wearing our rain gear. That's what we're doing today. Car is parked and that's it. We are going to go to the entrance of where we're supposed to be walking. There's my beautiful daughter with her pack. It's a three day walk and yeah. We're excited. You remember where we start, Erica? You remember where we start? It's really beautiful. It smells amazing up here, and I can't wait to get right into the woods. So hopefully, I'll be able to show you some beautiful spots. I'm supposed to get to the bridge. My bag feels a little wobbly. I have to tighten it over my shoulders, maybe a bit. So we're wearing our puffies because it's a little cooler than we expected. They said the weather was supposed to be nice. Mind you, it's gonna probably go to 20 today. And uh, but we're wearing our puffies and our raincoats because we did catch rain coming up. So we're all equipped. Poles in hand, we're off for our journey. We're not gonna have any Wi-Fi, but we do have our in-reach, right, Erica? Yeah, right here. And we're gonna be getting water from the lakes, and all is good. So as soon as I see another exciting spot, guys, I will let you join us. So is this where we have to go? I'm depending on my daughter. She's got the radar. If it was up to me, we'd be lost by now. But it's all good. Yeah. Hopefully we don't have any bear encounters. I have my bear bell, but I hear nothing. I'll keep it when we get in there. <laughs> Maybe I should have the bear bell in front of me and not hanging where it's hanging. Okay. But it's really beautiful here. So apparently our first part of the hike is all up here, uphill. They told us to get here early. We left early this morning. This is already a workout. We're not even on the trail yet. <laughs> <laughs> oh my lord. Well, this is the first of many, Erica. This is the bridge. Okay. That's it, we have to cross the bridge and then we're on our path. So, hang in there guys. Let me see, we have to go to, yeah, this way. We're going, the first, our first stop is Lolito. And yeah, I'm excited. Hopefully all that walking kept me in shape. And all is good. Look how beautiful. Really pretty up here. You're so beautiful. You are. I'm not gonna bother you. Get her munching away. Oh, she's so slow. <laughs> huh? 
Do you see the witch's butter? Did you see witch's butter on the tree? Some witch's butter. We are still on the bike trail, guys. We have to take the bike trail, and then we're gonna go into the trail towards Lito. And that's where we're gonna have, uh, that's where we're gonna rest for the rest of the day. It's so beautiful and peaceful. All you hear is nature. And my daughter's music hanging off her bag. But it is so beautiful. Can't see it very well yet. But it's simply beautiful. That is. Look, sorry about that. Where are we? Lac Monroe, I believe. Oh, it's still Lac Monroe? Could be past the. Oh, yeah. For Lac Monroe, I think. Oh, let me see it. Let me open this up. Like, yeah. Lac Monroe. We're on the. This is Lac Monroe, not Lac Superior. We were on the other side. So Lac Superior was, yeah. We were on the other side. Lac Superior was when we were driving. When we were driving, we were on Lac Superior. When we got in, that was Lac Monroe. Okay, so this is Lac Monroe. We're on the other side. It's so quiet and peaceful, though. Yes, guys, if you don't know who Mowgli is, check her out. Her music is amazing. My daughter bought us tickets and we went to see her. She's such a, she's so humble. She's so beautiful. And it was the first time she came to Canada and she actually sold out. We, there was about 30, 30 so people that helped her get here. So she could perform for us and uh, now she's going to be touring Canada. Yeah. Nature inspired. Very beautiful. So if you haven't checked her out yet, check her out. Her, she goes by Mowgli. Not only is she beautiful to look at, she sings like an angel. What are you looking at Eric? We did find morels the other day, but there was so few and so little where we went. You never know. We might find some to, today, and if we do, probably have some for, for either lunch or dinner. This is good. Beautiful. 
It is in the AT and it is in the PC, but trust me, my daughter and I will be doing those. But it's a little hike. I think next year we're gonna go to Newfoundland and we're gonna do the trail all along the, the ocean line. And that's gonna be 15 days hiking trail. But we're gonna do more up here. There's another bigger one up here that takes five days to come out. This one's only three days. But you know, for the first time, I think it's good. Gets us in shape for the bigger ones. And boy, is my bag heavy. I'm not sure if you took a good look at my bag. There's a lot of stuff in here. Basically, we're carrying our house with us. But you know, I've been training for it. So, I feel the weight, but it's not uncomfortable. But I am getting hot now. We had a little bit of sun earlier. And it's supposed to get nice and warm and sunny today. But for now, we're still wearing our puffy and our rain jackets. There's plenty of water source up here. That's one thing we're not going to run out of water. It's crazy. Everywhere you go, there's water. More there. Just running right through. I'm not sure if you can see it. Beautiful. I'm coming. Wait for your mama. Wait for the old lady. Don't be showing off again. I'm gonna have to start walking like a little old lady from Pasadena. Love you, Erica. More water, guys. Water everywhere. Yeah, where we are. There's over 400 lakes. Doesn't look it, but it's all uphill, guys. Up, up, up we go. So, if you've never hiked before and you wanna just go in it heads on, I say there's one that's uh, an easier path where everything is flat. This is not even the hardest trail. The hardest one is the five day one that we will be doing this summer, hopefully. But yeah, this one is always going up. So the poles come really handy to give you a little boost. And because it rained, everything is just, oh, the smells in here. I can't even tell you. I wish this was like smell of vision Hey, Erica, the smells, the smells are crazy. It's so fresh. It's like what every house would like to smell like. We go out and we spend all kinds of money on air freshener. And uh, all you have to do is spend a couple of days in the woods and you have it. I'm getting hot. I might have to start shedding some clothes, my love. Yeah. yeah. I think I only need my rain jacket, not the pepper. I might take it all off. I've got my hiking shirt on. It's got a nice air vent in the back. So if you get wet, it dries up really fast. Look how beautiful it is.
Hey bear. This is the magic forest right there. Water everywhere. Nobody's gonna die of thirst in here. Okay. Hey, bear. We even saw Chaga earlier, but like my daughter said, our bags are so heavy that we want to carry anything extra. Maybe if we're heading out, when we head out, if we see any, we might take some. But boy, we don't want to put more than we have to in these bags, in these bags because they're really, really. And here's our signs. Look at that. We are really going fast, eh? My God, we're walking. What is wrong with us? We were just here an hour ago. We're walking fast. Look, show them. Eh? We started here, and we went all the way, we're right here. I know, we're fast. What the heck? What are we gonna do for the day? I don't know. Spend it in the hut? <laughs> Relax well, our back. We can eat at the waterfall. Yeah, we're gonna go to the waterfall and we're gonna eat something there. What the heck? Yeah, we're making good time, that's for sure. Oh, you know what? We could relax. We were up early, right? Read a book, talk a little, bond, daughter and mother, right? Look for mushrooms. <laughs> that's good. That's good. It's but it's not that bad. We've also been practicing, eh? Well, we also have a 20 kilometer day on the last day, so that's really fun. <laughs> yeah. Well, at least we know we're not going to be stuck in the dark. That we're going to make it before the dark, that's for sure. And like I said, no one is going to be thirsty on this hike. If you guys are in Canada, you have to come to... If you're in Quebec, you definitely have to come to Mont Tremblant. It's so beautiful. Water everywhere. We will not be thirsty, that is for sure.
more water over here. Sounds like faster moving water. How pretty. Hey. Did you take a still picture? My daughter's enjoying some nature. Might as well enjoy it, right? We're walking so fast, we're gonna make it to camp before time. Yeah. Hold on. Let me hold you. Come on. Oh, I'm holding you anyway. This is so good for you guys. I can't even tell you how good this is. come all the way up here and then you start coming down. They grow everywhere. That's what I need to guys. This is medicine at your fingertips. Man, this guy wants to throw me over. <laughs> I'm holding you. My daughter's going outside. That's good, eh? I think that's enough. Yeah, we can even find more on our way. come in purple, they come in white, they come in yellow. These are edible, they're great in salads. So maybe I'll pick a couple of little bundles and we'll add it to our mix. I'm holding you. I'm holding you. See what they look like? The leaves are the shape of a heart and the flowers look like a little pansy. And these are edible. You could eat them cooked, the leaves, they taste just like spinach. Or you could throw them fresh in a salad, and the flowers are also edible. So there's another little bundle here that I'm going to take. Oh my god, get back. Hey bear! Give me a smile, beautiful.
What's that song? Ring, 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 ring my bell. Hey bear! So beautiful. There's no lacking of water. Four hundred lakes in Mont Tremblant. Okay, so we just met another hiker and she started days ago, but she started the other way around. She started where we're going towards. Look how beautiful. So pretty. And uh, she says to get ready because this is the easy trail, which my daughter and I could agree. Because when she told, when the lady told us that this one is a difficult one, we kind of looked at each other and Erica said, Ma. This can be so difficult. This is pretty easy. And sure enough, she told us that this is the easy trail. The difficult one is coming ahead of us. So, that's okay. We are ready. Right, Eric? Mm -hmm. We can do this. I've got rocks in my shoes. It's getting really hot now and I wanna strip down. I'm wearing too much clothes on my body. I really want to, but I want to find a spot to lay this bag down because I need some elevation to help me put it back up. It's so heavy. My bag is really, really heavy. But yeah, I guess you'll get to see what it's like on our trail. But definitely this is not as hard as she told us it would be. But I don't know. Heading towards the chute. There's some nice waterfalls up here. So I'll show you when we get there, guys. Okay? Oh, okay. well, perfect. And there's a hell of I don't even have to. Look at that. We don't even have to dig a cat hole. This is great. I will definitely take advantage of that. Beautiful. Okay. Is that snow? Is that a little bit of snow there? Looks like it. Still a little bit of snow. Look, snow there, a little bit there. Wow. Come on, snow, you gotta go. <laughs> nice little area. There's a place to go potty, so we don't even have to, because I was telling my daughter I would have to go, so she says, go dig a hole, Ma. But we don't even have to do that, so I brought a little shovel for nothing. But it's always good to have a place to sit down. I'm going to definitely remove some of my clothing. So I'll check in with you in a bit, guys. A nice little spot to look at the water running up there. Do you see it? That's good drinking water right there. Beautiful water. 
My daughter's shedding her clothes. Ah. Take it off, Erica. Oh, I did. Okay. Tie your hair up or the bugs are going to make a dinner out of your neck. Okay, bye. Okay. I'm not sure if you could see it. I to zoom. Yeah, can you zoom it for me? Am I in the right place? Right there. There it is. You see that guys? Oh, we're connected to my chest. Just there. That's Chaga. That black second growth. one. Yeah. Second one we've seen. Hold on, hold this. Fortunately this one's so far up. There it is, right there. This one's so far up, we, we wouldn't even be able to get it if we want to. But that stuff is so good for us. We buy it and it costs an arm and a leg to buy that. So, second chaga we've seen. This is impressive. This is like the forest of abundance. But if I see any low, for sure I'm going to take it. Just a little bit. I'm not going to be greedy. But it's so beautiful, guys. We've met day hikers. We've met uh, people on bikes, cyclists, because this is still the bike path we're on. Oh, we're on Zoom, eh? We're still on the bike path, but I gotta be careful with my poles because I jammed, I jammed the poles on my daughter's. Where? On the ground. On the. Is that a? Is that Taga? Is that a birch? A birch? Yeah. Then that's probably chaga, yeah. Knock it off. Use your... Oh, let me see. Oh. I jammed my pole in my daughter's ankle and I ripped her pants. Do you need a knife? You got the... Right yeah. Is it? Yeah. No. Yes. You got to break it. It's brown see. inside. Yeah, but when you break it off? No. I don't think so. Yes, you got to bring the chunk off to see. There it is. Oh, wow. It is. It's chaga. Okay, well, how are we going to carry all this stuff? Put it in. Okay, I'm there it the is. Other one. Look at that. I need to take the... Uh... We got chaga. Jeez. Look at that, guys. Free chaga. Oh, my God. It smells so good. There it is, guys. Free chaga. So we've got our chicory that we're going to put in a wrap. We've got some chaga to make some delicious tea. Be careful, Erica. Uh, you have a knife in that bag. Be careful. See the bag you have in your hands? My knife is there. Just have to clean it off a bit. But beautiful. Look at that. Yay, thank you, universe. An abundance. Yeah? See it? Oh, well, yeah, it is how you have to jam it. You have to jam the blade underneath. Which blade do you have? Yours or mine? Mine is a firmer blade. Yeah. Don't be greedy. Put it in the bag with the chicory. That's a treasure bag. There you go. Put it in the bag. Here, I'll hold the pose. Oh, so, the sun came oh, out. Oh, beautiful. So yes, I jammed the, I jammed. Oh, I've got you looking the other way. Um, I jammed, there's a, some more chaga. I jammed the pull on my daughter's leg and all I did was rip her pants, but I'm surprised I didn't hurt her. Sorry, Erica. Mom's oh, going to buy it. you. <laughs> oh, <sorry>. I felt it. <laughs> I was swinging my pole, yeah. not realizing how close my daughter was. Yeah, got it? You put it underneath so you don't 
squish the down. There we go. How are we going to... We're going to make tea with that. And I... Uh, we found our first chaga. Yeah, I know. This is, I'm so excited right now. That's the so, first time we found I owe her a pair of tights. I do, I do. She was more worried about her socks. Go figure. <laughs> All right, guys. When it gets a little prettier, I'll show you what the trail looks like. So I'll see you in a bit. Water everywhere, guys. An abundance of water up here. Look how pretty that is. It's so beautiful up here. I'm so happy we came here. I'm glad that we did this for the first, our first trip. So now we have chicory, which for some of you, you're probably saying chicory, really? Yeah. Uh, we've got chicory to put in our wraps. We've got chaga to make some chaga tea or chaga coffee, however you want to call it. We're going to mix it with fur needles. It smells so good. And uh, we're going to make a nice tea for us when we finally settle in. But yes, this is our first chaga. We've been looking for chaga for the longest time. And we found it here. How nice. And we didn't even have to look hard for it. No. We didn't even have, you see, that's the thing. I find when you're looking for something, you're so focused in trying to find what you're looking for, that you never find it. But if you just enjoy your walk, look around, look at the beauty that's all around us, and then you start spotting all kinds of stuff, like chaga, beautiful creatures, friendly people you meet on the trail. We met one hiker who's been, this is her last, her last day, obviously, because she went the other way. And uh, we met some day hikers, some bikers, and they're all so friendly. They're all happy to see you. And I'm so happy to do this with my daughter. I wish my other daughter was with me too. But I will drag her out one day. It's the last thing I'm gonna do. I'm gonna drag Amanda out with us. And we'll do it together, three women. So beautiful. And it's so still here. All you hear is Erica's beer bell. <laughs> That's okay. But you know what? It's better to warn them than to surprise them. You never want to surprise a bear, especially if it has a little baby with them. So here's this lady telling us that this is the hardest part of the hike. And we found out this is the easy part of the hike. I mean, it's still hard because it's going uphill. Makes you want to see what we what we have coming ahead of us. So, so pretty. Are you going to jab me? Are you going to jab me? <laughs> no, don't. Don't say those things. I saw you and you look great. You hear that? They're calling Negan. Talk about Negan. Why am I starting to like that man now? I wanted to kill that guy after what he did. And now he's growing on me. After he saved her. How could you not? You know what this hike is doing, right? It's giving me the itch to do the big one. I would love to see Dixie do the Canadian Trail. So Dixie, I don't think you'll ever watch my channel, but if you ever do, or someone, they're pretty, eh? What are they? They open up into like little yellow orangey flowers. But if anybody watches this who knows who Dixie is, tell her we would love to see her do the Canadian Trail. 
I would love for her to do that. Okay, so we're off here now. Now we're going into a path for sure. Oh no, we have to go to the chute first, right? Well, we don't have to. Well, we could. Yeah, I'd like I, to see it. I would it. like to see it, yeah. Of course. Because we have to go up there now to go to the hut. But I want to see this. Yeah, we're going to see the chute first. Yeah. See, we have to go up there. This is the climb, I think. Aye, aye. Yeah. All right. We'll do it. That's okay. That's okay. Oh, we have good timing though. We have all day. Okay? Okay. So, when we get to the shoot, I'll show you guys. What is that sound? It's beautiful, eh? Look how pretty. There's so many lakes. Then it goes out towards here. Look how beautiful this is. Beautiful. And my father-in-law used to come up here all the time. This country house is not far from here. Look how beautiful. Hey, Erica. Yeah. Nano. Nano used to be always up here. Yeah. So our exit is further up that way, but we want to come and see the the shoot. So we're making the extra footage so we could just see. Look, that tree branch is coming down for sure. You see it? Came down. So we're going to walk a little extra just so we can get to see the beautiful shoes. And then we're going to head back and we're going to go to our walk up our campsite. A little wet. Oh, the sun's out. Yeah, beautiful. I'm so happy I'm doing this. I feel so close to nature. This is so beautiful. How beautiful is this place? Aren't you glad you came? Hey? Look at that guy. Uh, I feel like I'm on a boat. <laughs> How, beautiful. How beautiful is this, guys? like titanic water how beautiful You're getting wet <laughs> beautiful 
beautiful. It's so beautiful. There's that other trail if you want to go see what there is on that end. Oh, it does make you dizzy. Eh? Makes you dizzy if you turn too fast. Takes your breath away. Huh? It takes your breath away. Hey? What is this? The top of the water. The top. So beautiful. Wet leaves. Man, that's some strong current. Okay, guys. So we finally made it to our trail. We started this morning. We got here, oh, what, nine, I think? Yeah, it was about nine. No, because we started on the trail at, what, 10.30? No. Yeah. Was it? Yeah, we started, we were walking at 10.30. Was it 10.30? So, yeah. So we got here maybe like 10. Okay, so. To 10. Oh yeah, because when we wa when I checked, we were already walking. Yeah. Okay, so we finally got on the bike pad at 10, and uh, it is now yeah 1:30, and we finally just started our trail. So this is it, and well, apparently we've been on the trail, but this, we've is, been on the trail, but this is leading us to uh, Lito, where our hut's gonna be. Oh yeah, okay. How beautiful is this trail? Oh my lord. It's so nice. I'm so happy we're doing this. It's so beautiful. Hard to film though with one, one stick. You really need two sticks to come up here. See, we've been training for this in West Mount. We have been training. It's, it's the exact same. Like it feels the same walking up those, those roads. The same. There you go. Good. So beautiful. We have to walk the time for
This is paradise, guys. If you want to go to paradise and know what it feels like, you have to come up here. This is for sure what it feels like to die and go to heaven. We have been going. My daughter must be dying of heat with her frog on. Okay. You're okay? Yeah. We've been going uphill, but I mean uphill. When I was going uphill in my last videos, those were little molehills compared to what we've been doing. My legs are tired, that is for sure. But my breathing is good. So the workouts, have paid off, that's for sure. So beautiful. If I could, I would live up here. Hey, Erica? Huh? A nice little hut live here, to live. Yeah. Imagine have to do all of this just to come to your cabin. Oh, Lord. <laughs> I'm telling you, I take my hat off to all those hikers I've been watching. Second chance. If you're out there and you even have a moment to watch this little video because we're only doing a three-day hike. But I am so proud of you from when you started and how much you've accomplished because it is not easy to hike. That's for sure. You really have to put your mind there and go forward. It's not something that you say, yeah, I can do it. It's not as easy when you start doing it. So hats off to you, Second Chance. You're amazing. Smiles, you're another one who's doing this. And you guys have lost so much weight. You should be so proud of yourself because this is amazing. I mean, we only have three days in here, but you guys have been doing it for months now. Weeks, months. So I salute you guys. Dixie, I watch all your videos. You're pretty awesome. You taught me what to buy, what not to buy. Maybe I should have listened to you a little more when you showed us some of that light gear. <laughs> Thank God we're not carrying a tent because we don't need it up here. But you guys are troopers. Pretty impressive. That is for sure. After you start hiking, and, and this is not flat. So, you know, I got to take my hat off to us too because this is all going uphill. Any any type of hiking is good hiking for me. Here we go, uphill again. It just doesn't end. We're always going up. Well, nice to know that there's a lake up where we're gonna have our hut and our hut's on top of a mountain. Isn't that nice? So, pretty good. I'm happy. What do you say, Erica? How impressive are those hikers that do the AT and the PC and the awesome. CT? They really are. This is crazy. They are awesome. You know, black toenails, <laughs> bleeding shins. Hey, bear. We don't have grizzlies here, so we have lots of black bears up here. Haven't seen any yet, so we're happy. Or should we say we haven't encountered any? Okay, guys. More water. Water, water everywhere. No lack of water, that's for sure. Water, water, everywhere. How beautiful. It's just heaven. This is paradise. Okay, guys. I'll see you in a bit. For more videos like this, make sure to subscribe to Connie's Rawson Kitchen. Give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends.